Hello! Today I'm out in Forest Hills, Queens. Forest Hills has been one of my favorite neighborhoods since I first discovered it seven years ago. The Long Island Railroad runs through this neighborhood, making a trip to Manhattan a short 30 minute ride. You can enjoy the comfort and convenience with the Long Island Railroad in Forest Hills. Right by the Forest Hills Terminal, you can enjoy Austin Street. This is the main street lined with restaurants, shopping, and nightlife. There are plenty to choose from, including Sephora, Martha's Country Bakery, Target, Gregory's Coffee, Buffalo Wild Wings, and Age Steakhouse. A subsection known as Forest Hills Gardens is a coveted area within Queens. On the private streets of Forest Hills Gardens, you can't park your car in this neighborhood. However, you can stroll through its quiet, tree-lined streets and take in its Tudor-inspired mansions and estates. Developed in the early 1900s, Forest Hills Gardens is made up of beautiful Tudor-style homes, co-op buildings, and manicured gardens. The neighborhood was planned and developed by Frederick Law Olmsted Jr., son of the renowned landscape architect who designed Central Park. Olmsted Jr. envisioned a serene residential area that would be nature-based with winding streets and spacious lawns, which he achieved by using the ideas of the Garden City Movement, a British movement that proposed a model for town planning. The Forest Hill Stadium is a legendary attraction in the neighborhood. The stadium began booking concerts in the 1960s and went on to host some of the most culturally significant performances of the time. Frank Sinatra, Barbara Streisand, The Rolling Stones, and Bob Dylan. Strolling through the neighborhood, you'll enjoy the beautiful architect starting from the Tudor-inspired to cobblestone facades. You'll notice homes in this neighborhood have maintained a lot of their original charm. The Forest Hills Historic District was passed by City Council and became a locally designated historic district on March 8, 2017. Home sales in Forest Hills range from slightly over 1 million to over 4 million, and homes like this one just sold for 3.8 million. Now there's a hidden gem tucked away from Austin Street located on Burn Street and 68th Avenue. Hello. Hi, how are you? Yeah, so what do you recommend here? What's your popular drink right now? Sure, yeah, so we have our signature latte. It's called the Forest Latte. It's the combination of maple syrup and cinnamon. And then we could add that same combination to pretty much any other drink on the menu. It's called Foresting Our Drinks. Okay, I'll try it. Sure. And did you want that ice or hot? Hot. Got it. And what kind of milk would you like? Uh, oat milk. Got it. And is regular sweetness okay? Yeah. Anything else for you today? That's it, thanks. Got it. And can I just have a name for the order? Natalia. Got it, Natalia. Thank you so much. Oh yeah, that's good. All right, let's move on to Forest Park. The third largest park in Queens, Forest Park is 543 acres and sits atop a ridge overlooking the southern plains of Jamaica Bay. Visitors can explore its network of trails, which cater to both leisurely walks and more vigorous hikes. These trails offer opportunities for bird watching, wildlife observation, and a chance to escape the urban environment. One of the park's notable features is the Forest Park Carousel, a historic attraction dating back to the early 20th century. This beautifully restored carousel delights visitors with its hand-carved figures and nostalgic charm. Sports enthusiasts can enjoy various facilities within the park, including baseball fields, tennis courts, and a golf course. And for those seeking relaxation, Forest Park offers serene spots, such as the Forest Park Golf Course and the park's numerous ponds, which are ideal for fishing or simply enjoying a moment of tranquility in nature. 
Throughout the year, Forest Park hosts community events, nature walks, and educational programs, engaging visitors of all ages in the appreciation of nature and conservation efforts. So there you go. I hope you enjoyed my video about Forest Hills. If you'd like to learn more, just drop some questions in the comments and don't forget to subscribe to my channel.